Hallo, dit is Stevens hier, Senior Ender at the Internet Storm Center. My diary and here PNG analysis shows you a bit uh, how to use my tool PNG dump to analyze uh, well, malicious PNG files and, and benign PNG files. So I'm going to show you one that uh, is also here in the, the diary entry and it's one with an iced ID payload. So I run my tool PNG dump on that file. And so, first of all, here you get different items, a header and then chunks, all in the structure of the PNG file with here the position where it is found. After the header, the default header, you have different chunks, they have a name four bytes like ear i header srgb gamma fis i that i end and i end is the end of uh, the png file then you have the length of each chunk and a chunk has also a crc32 code for the data that it has and the tool checks of that checksum is correct so here everything looks okay so this image 3930 pixels width, 1999 height, 8 color bits, color type 2, and then compression method 0, filter method 0, interlace method 0. Compression method 0 means that the data of the image, the, the bitmap that is contained in IDAT, is Zlib compressed. And up till now that's the only compression support supported by the PNG format. So everything that is in IDAT here, that data, and you can have more than one IDAT uh, entries. Well, that is one long compressed stream. And here my tool gathers all the information from the IDATs and then tries to decompress this. And on this image here, this fails. So although the structure of this image is correct there's actually no valid bitmap here in here because it cannot be decompressed so this image cannot be rendered and that is where uh, the ice id is uh, hidden so i can select the uncompressed IDAT, so the i mean the um, idats uh, in raw format uh, without decompression all of the data is in there like this and that's the data and if I do a binary dump of that bit data and put this into my byte stats tool you can see a very high entropy almost 8 that's because that data here is RC4 encrypted and I wrote a small script based on existing scripts I can find on github to, to decrypt this information so I made a small script decrypt iceid with uh, a decrypt function and, and a check function that you can use with my translate tool so you select the idats here and then you run my translate tool that takes input in byte format there's a transformation on it and then outputs bytes so we are going to load a script here that's that uh, decrypt script that I made and we are going to run on the full stream not byte per byte but on the full stream in one go and first we run the check function and then we get this output at offset zero a header was found and this is a typical header for that ice ID um, shellcode RC4 encryption, the decrypted size, the shellcode entry point, and then the size here, shellcode. And then I can also decrypt this. Now this will spit out binary data. So what I'm going to do is just pipe this into my strings tool, and then we can at least see some strings. So here now we have decrypted data because if we run this 
on the unencrypted data see we don't get any readable strings <laughs> 